want to say goodbye. You two were there the first time I opened my eyes as the flesh. I couldn't be the hero I am without you guys. Tell Joe and Iris I love them. We will. Sorry, kid, but this has to happen. Barry, what are you doing? I'm momentarily stealing your speed. If you play this speed for day long enough, you learn some neat tricks. Wait, why are you doing this? Novu said the Flash must die in crisis. He never said which one. to get in that force field. No. Do you want your friend to die? Let me do this. Let me save you all. Cisco, don't. Oh, Cisco. Come on. Thank you. Keep riding the lightning, son. I know you'll make us all proud. You made me team leader, and sometimes a leader has to make the tough choices. We gotta stay here. Let's go. No. Let's go. No. Barry, right. let's go. I'm not going. Come on. Faith in you too. Well, the truth is, I have faith in you too. smarter than you <laughs> I doubt that you know Alan for your plan to work you're gonna actually have to have his dagger in your possession we've got that covered you've got that covered how's that with this is, is that a piece of avatar suit yeah hmm you know what's funny about your dad Nora she hates me, hates me with a passion. And yet, a version of him, this avatar, much bigger jerk than I ever was. Did you see the face? Did you, did you see the like, pizza face? Can you hurry up. Yeah, I'll hurry up. I gotta tell you, Alan, you know, using this avatar suit, it's a smart idea. That was hers. Clever girl. Oops. Gotta go. I still look forward to seeing how this all pans out. All right. Hey, Dad. It's time to go back to the night it all began. Come on.
Jones to Seals. See if we can talk Joe into whipping us up a pot of his famous jambalaya. That's not funny, Barry. OK, ask him to grill some burgers instead. Why are you doing that? Doing what? Acting like Joe's still alive, man. What are you talking about? You don't remember? Barry, Joe died six months ago. You know that. This is my exit. Yeah. Oh. Right. Yeah. <sighs> Jesse, the reason that I can't talk you about it. It's it's okay. You don't have to explain. I don't. I don't. Well, that's what you wanted. Yeah. Um. I don't know. I thought making you confront all the emotions that you have with losing mom would help you move on, be happy again. But I can't decide when you're ready to do that. Only you can, so I'm, I'm sorry. If... No, don't no, be sorry, it's okay. okay. I do want you to know, though, if the time comes and you want to talk about it, I'm here. Actually, if that's the case, why don't you stick around for a little bit longer? What, you want to talk now? No, I'd like you to listen. Have a seat. I'm going to fix this to your forehead. What is that? It's the streamlined version of T.A. Cecile Horton's mental activity dampener. Nice upgrade. Thank you. But I thought this was uh, supposed to block out people's thoughts. Not anymore. Now, it allows you to hear them. Lose that love. <laughs> anyway, um, maybe this will help you understand why it's been so hard for me. <laughs> because in the vast night sky, you are the only star. She's a miracle. Jesse. She's just like me. Sweetie. Come here. Be with me.
Gideon. Yes, Professor Thorne? Where the hell am I? 